Hi students welcome to AutoCAD Electrical 2021 Most of the time students get confused in wire numbering sometimes students get question mark in their wire numbers and sometimes random numbers and they think wire numbering is not working we will see in detail how we can tackle such problems we will try to discuss most of the options but will also leave some for your own practice in the open drawing you can see that uh, there is a question mark before the alphabets this is actually because it is not reading this value and when autocad is not allowed to read a value it will assign a question mark with that value so this is actually my r suffixes a b c d and these are working all right but the first value is not working it was actually the reference number i have selected this option and it was not reading this value because i haven't given any reference number to my drawing so that's why it's creating problem now moving towards other drawing and uh, uh, discuss all about all options here you can see we have already discussed about the sequential number like in 1 2 3 4 so here i have enter another number 5 km 1 so this is actually my alpha numeric value and uh, here i have selected the xy grid format referencing so my spacing i have already we have already discussed about these i have picked this uh, origin and selected this option for my setup and uh, click enter now giving the wire numbers my sequential number is uh, this one and it will be incremented with 1 if i select this option all the wires will be numbered in proper order so you can see that or uh, this is actually my sub, uh, prefix 5 km and these are our sequential numbers you can see all the numbers are properly assigned and uh, look at this wire which is uh, the this is actually touching this wire so it assign a single value to both the wires because these are actually a single wire we are now moving towards the other option and uh, see other properties like line reference i want to select uh, these options like 1 2 3 and so on these are suffix numbers it will be assigned at the end of the option now this is a numbering of horizontal and vertical format so select okay these are already numbered now i want to remove these numbers from the wires how i can remove these numbers so i will move here and you uh, in the edit wire wire numbers and select the delete wire numbers i can also enter the command ae erase wire number so select all the wires To and click enter. All the wire numbers will be removed. Now again, enter the wire number. I have selected the X Y grid and uh, drawing wide. You can see that this is at A minus two, A minus three. So it is reading actually from from the X Y grid. This is actually the A value. This is B C and D uh, E F. And these are zero, one, two. Uh, sorry, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here, let's suppose I want to enter. Uh, also percent uh, s and if you want to enter some space mm, line referencing i can enter this one and xy grid it is uh, all right now again remove all the wire numbers enter the wire xy grid in this uh, fashion you can see that this is actually my format now so i have entered the different format which was Uh, in my wire number i have entered the percent n and percent s so percent n is this is the percent n while this is my sheet number this one shows my sheet number with negative sign if i select it and removed it with a, a divide sign and see you can you can work in on these properties in your own fashion as you want so remove all these wire numbers again and giving wire numbers so this is you can see that uh, it is uh, a minus 2 divided by 1 change my format referencing to x zone now starting uh, the value from 1 and click okay again remove all the wire numbers select all the wire numbers select all the wires all the wire numbers will be removed now giving the wire numbers x zone you can see this is my x zone value mean it is a starting from the second value this wire number is starting from the second value this is my x uh, x axis and here you can see this is my first value so 
these values are assigned first one value and similarly here you can see that this is starting from two while this is starting this while is starting from three you can see this is my third value this is my third value so its value is assigned as three this is x value and this is my suffix value similarly we can also change the suffix value from here uh, let's suppose i want to enter the a b c d and uh, remove again while numbers giving while number drawing wide you can see that these are changed to my alphabets while number reference we can also give the suffix number our own value let's suppose we have different wires for different reference numbers uh, we can enter the suffix values according to our requirement in autocad electrical you may have uh, seen such type of drawings in which you can see that uh, there are prefixes and suffixes so the, here you can see 5 km this is a fixed value 5 km 5 km so these are actually the values which we can assign so these are uh, while numbers these are component numbers i have entered the different suffix values and uh, let's see how it will affect my drawing now in drawing properties i will select this option and and uh, see what will happen when i give numbers to my drawing you can see uh, this is uh, ps1 and uh, ps1 ps2 ps1 this is d f e these are some random numbers i don't know why it is giving the random numbers to my drawing if you can see in your drawing properties the spacing you can see, see this is this is the actual problem which i am facing in my this drawing i have not given the exact spacing between the numbers i have also not fixed the origin of my drawing so that's why it is giving some random numbers to my drawing so we will have to change our settings and we will give the different format settings like i have entered here i have picked my origin i have selected this option vertical horizontal and separator is my this is my separator and see what will happen in to my drawing and remove first remove all the wire numbers and then give wire numbering to my in this value you can see this is a dash between the two wires this is actually my separator x and y these values are you can see these are a b c d these are in this form while in one two three four is it is starting from here you will also find such type of uh, mm, templates in your drawings but in other format zero which is my first value starting from this direction and moving towards downward mm, i have divided this whole distance and this distance which i get the values of 5 and 3.6 my horizontal value is 1 2 3 and my vertical value is a so i yeah, i want to get vertical value first and horizontal value second that's why i enter my vertical value is uh, this is my vertical value which i have selected as first and this is my horizontal value you can see that uh, this is starting from this value which is uh, a actually i have I have selected this corner so it is incrementing values from this corner like it is assuming it as a and b and c and d and so similarly it is uh, assuming it as one two three four so this is my a and this is my one so it is starting from a and one mean a a by one and this one this is actually the suffix value a b c is the suffix value similarly it is uh, starting from the second alphabet and which is b and it is starting from the second second digit which is actually my second value b by 2 here my wire, wire numbering will start from this point so this is my starting point of my wire so it will look at this point and this point so you can see that this is my b while this is my second value so b by 2 this is my b by 2 and b by 3 so why it assume b by 3 value you can see that this wire come in the third value 